The resumption of the crude oil export in Sirijas Block 5A, described to be a milestone in boosting funding for the government and community development program in South Sudan, is speaking to the media. The Petroleum Minister, Honorable Pot Kang Chol, said the government is planning to produce over 16,000 barrels per day when Sudanese government have lifted exposed capping limit in elite central refinery. Today, we shall be producing 3,000 barrels a day. It will increase gradually and it will go up to 16,000 barrels a day, which is the limit that is imposed on us by uh, the government of Sudan. Uh, but we are engaging the government of Sudan to uncap the refinery so that we will produce uh, up to 80, if not 100,000 barrels a day. The Minister of Environment and Forestry, Honorable Josephine Nafon Cosmos, had the oil investors to adhere to the national standard of ensuring safe environment for people living in oil producing area. Again, I would like to tell our oil companies that let us cooperate, let us find solutions into this environmental pollution. And anybody who will not cooperate as the government of South Sudan will not is to stop you from operation. Minister of Labor, James Osmai, said after the marketing assessment, the ministry in collaboration with the Minister of Petroleum would implement a unified human resource policy manual to ensure the equal fate on equal job. Last week, the cabinet approved a program presented by the Minister of Petroleum. That program contains a lot of things. Among them is, was the local contents and the unified human resource so that we have to put the right people in the right place. The Governor of the United States, Dr. Joseph Mantil, a field to suit petroleum operating company to improve the delivery of the essential basic service. The CD that you have in your structures, which is meant to take care of the community. And it is time now for CD to take over its responsibility, to renovate and to add more schools and pay CEOs. What a networking. The governor of Warab State, General Ali Wayang, said the leadership of North and Corridor Block would food measures to improve on security to allow the peaceful atmosphere for investors. Rest assured, my brother, the president, that there is a political will in Juba. And there is, and we have been tasked to provide you with utmost security we can provide. The Espoges President Eric Gary called on government and host community to work in coordination to address the concern put forward by the community and disclose companies' plan to allocate funds for community development. Espoges have not only brought the production of oil, but we have also brought water with us with the upgrade of our resumption and the water treatment plan. ESPO keeps our HSC practices at the highest level possible in line with the ESPO health, safety and environment policy statement. The delegation also launched water treatment plan that would benefit 200,000 households. Sergius Block 5A would initially produce 3,000 barrels a day with an increase to 8,000 barrels per day at the end of the year, reporting for SSBC. Gatujual, United States, Sergas Oil.